Let's get it. It is an absolutely gorgeous day here in the Carolinas. Pardon me, and I'm so glad to see it. I do hope everyone is well and that you're able to get out and enjoy this day. Which this is the day the Most High has made in order for us to rejoice in and be glad. It's also one that we must find our being in Him as the text says live and move and find our being in him. And I'm so grateful for it. Hallelujah. Have an early start today. Quite a full day ahead of us. And I thank the most high for strength and wisdom. Handle these jobs accordingly as we're asked to do. Imperfection. As we follow and listen to Him, we have the strength and we're perfect in all our ways, like He's perfect in His ways. As we listen to Him, that is, don't come by doing it our own way. Praise the Most High. I do have a great thought for today, one that's not popular. Matter of fact, you hardly ever hear of it anymore. And it's something we were speaking on the other day. And that's hell. Mm. And how its gates or borders is enlarging itself. Oh boy. And that reminds me of how some of us eat. <laughs> oh. Oh boy, and you do know I'm talking about me in the past. I used to love to eat. I still love to eat, but I don't, well, I like to eat. I don't love it no more. See, when you love something, we gotta be careful how we say we love. Because we're only supposed to love the most high and the people he put in our lives to love, but on different levels. But we're not to love even. It's called gluttony. And I have been guilty of that, like I said in the past. But now the Most High is working with me as I listen to him, to where we're becoming perfect in that area. We have some ways to go, trust me. <laughs> Hallelujah some ways but we're maintaining our weight and even losing weight as the season change I believe also of course we're out here going to get it every day hustling and busting praise the most high back to hell mm, what a sad thing to say <laughs> but there's plenty levels of hell you must understand that first. Because it's not always the final destination hell. See, hell is a place where we put ourselves every time. We're not sent to hell or in hell because of someone else's decisions. Namely, the Most High. See, he didn't make hell for us. He made hell for the angels. For our Satan and his angels. Those that bucked against the Most High's will and plan for his creation. See, our Satan didn't like the Most High's attention to his creation. And putting man in charge of his creation. So he bucked. See, he would not bow down to man. See, he would lift his throne above the throne of the Most High. He had 
saying that he would be higher than the Most High. And he's created by the Most High. Hmm. Who that sound like? Oh boy. And see, that's why we're in the hell we put ourselves in. Because we say we're gonna put our throne above the Most High's throne of our heart. That's why we're in the hell we're in. A lot of us have what's called that me disease, that me and I disease, that me, 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 that I, I, I. And it shows. <clears throat> oh boy, how it shows. Because of the hell we're in, the circumstances we put ourselves in. But praise the Most High, as I said, or if I didn't, it doesn't have to be that way. Because the Most High didn't create hell for us, even in our circumstances or our environments. He said in his text, I wish above all things that you prosper and be in health, even as your soul prosper at heart. See, that takes some um, yielding to him and his voice in your ear every single day. That's how prospering happens. It's not an overnight thing. The text says, even as your soul prospers, that means it's, it's a step or steps. But yeah, my idea for today, pardon me, I should have gave it before now. We haven't got almost done with this thought, tell you the honest truth. Is if you can't stand the heat, stay up out the kitchen can't stand the heat, stay up out the kitchen. And see, we don't want no parts of hell, hell. <laughs> oh boy, no we don't. Boy, they say that's a bad place. The tech says it's a bad place. And we don't want no parts of it. Mm -mm. And we shouldn't want no parts of hell in our circumstances, in our life day to day. Not when there's a way provide a force to stay up out of it. <clears throat> but once again, it's gonna take some yielding. See what we have to realize, family, is that no matter what you do or where you go, in life and out the life, there's rules set up. And you got to follow the rules. See, that's something I didn't really wanna hear. As a teenager, and as a young man, I thought I was like um, one of the guys that discovered stuff. <laughs> I thought I could find a way to beat the system to where I didn't have to follow the rules. But oh boy, did I have a rude awakening. And every other individual like myself that's dead in prison and nine times out of ten in hell. Mm. And I don't know why, who should say, man? But I'm so glad he did. I don't know why he sacrificed his life. Oh, but I'm glad. I'm so glad he did. Hallelujah. I'm so glad he did. Praise the most high. See, I should have been one in hell a long time ago because of my choices and decisions. But the Most High was so gracious, he looked beyond my faults, hallelujah, and saw my need. And he saw this future where I'll be sitting here talking about my mess ups and how you don't have to go through the same mess. You don't have to suffer in hell day to day and the ultimate hell, you don't have to do it. So I'm saying don't do it. 
be greater than me. Do greater than I did. Start young if you're young. Get out here and live your life for the most high. Take exit you will not regret it. It's the best decision you can make. To give him your everything. A day, all day. Because none of us can stand the heat. So stay up out the kitchen. I love y'all. Stay up and keep pushing forward in the right direction. Shoot, boom. Yeah, fam, I just left a job. It was quite a pleasant experience. Even though <laughs> what I was assembling didn't have all the parts to the box. I still get paid, but that puts the customer in, in a somewhat bad mood. However, this young man had a beautiful attitude about it. And I believe it had to do with the music. <laughs> oh boy. He was listening to Billy Holiday. Hey, pardon me. But as I said, he was listening to Billy Holiday. And oh boy, what a what an album. Because he was playing on vinyl. Oh my goodness. It sounded so good, so common. And he got to a particular song that says mama may have, papa may have, but the most high blessed the child that has his own. And as I was leaving, I thought about that thing. I was like, how true that is. And this is the only thing that's gonna save us from a burning hell. And that's the child that has his own personal relationship with the most high. And that is a relationship where the most high has begun a great work in their lives. And I say begun a great work in their lives because even though we're striving for perfection, I don't believe we're gonna quite get there until we meet the man face to face. When we're given that glorified body. Because mm. as I said in the prior recording, The Most High came and visited me when I was in my mess and said, this is not how I see you. And he showed me how he saw me. Then he said, this is how I see you. And he showed me with what looked to me as a perfect being. And I said to myself, oh my, that's a beautiful person. And it was me. So I thank the Most High for that. And the, um, the idea. I got to share this testimony. <laughs> oh, boy. I was quite concerned about these, the jobs I lined up for today. And I can't even say quite concerned because I was simply concerned because the Most High always works them out. Now sometimes I take a job and I'll plan it according to what the item is, not according to the time they give me. Because I pretty much have a good idea on how much time it would take me to do each piece and then get to the next job. So I say I was concerned because that one job I left was supposed to end at 10. And I'm supposed to be to my next gig at 10. <laughs> oh boy, y'all see what I'm getting to, don't you? You see how the most high works? And of course I prayed and said, Father, you got to help me with this one. Even though they're in the same neck of the woods, the first job I had was a somewhat difficult piece to put together. 
and I wouldn't even say difficult, just time consuming. But I've gotten all these items down to a science through and by the Most High and His Ruach HaKadosh, leading me into all truth. But of course you pick up on things and you um, get the knack of it. Thank you. So I say praise the Most High. Carolina 16 North Providence Road. Hmm, thank the most. I'm not gonna get upset with this fella here. First he cut me off, now he slams on his brakes. But I don't know his situation. Looks like he's dealing with a chap in the back or something. I hope that's who we're dealing with. Not trying to make a point to me because I ain't his chap. Right. <laughs> we're staying in a great mood, family. I'm not getting that way today. I'm going to stay in one way. Straight truth. Oh, he done dropped something. Look like a phone or something he picked up. But praise the most high, there's no need for me to get out of myself. So I'm not giving up my shalom for nobody. Because what has happened is Yahusha has given me his shalom. Mm, mm, mm. And I walk in it. But yes, indeed. The only way for us to escape a burning hell is through and by the Ruach HaKadosh leading us into all truth. And us accepting the Most High's sacrifice of Yahushua HaMashiach as our master and savior. Turn right. Praise the most high. Continue for one mile. Yeah, you have to laugh at folks sometimes and let them go and enjoy their day. Out of your way. It's good to get out of people's way and let them do what they do and say, okay, shalom. Yes, indeed. But Billy Holiday said, Papa may have, or Mama may have, and Papa may have. But God bless the child that has his own. Mm. Most high blessed child has his own. See, I make a distinction of that simply because there is more than one God. And I like to give him his props every time I speak on his speak on him. So I say the most high Elohim. See Yahusha said himself that. Hasatan, the Elohim, or God of this world, in a quarter mile, turn right onto Fred God Drive. Has blinded the eyes of all of those who won't see the glorious gospel, light of the gospel truth, in my own words. Take the next right onto Fred God Drive, then turn right onto What a sad song. But family, that's why I make a distinction. And say the most high. Hmm. We're going to let that be our time for today. I do hope and pray we read over them scripts. Take the next right onto Neon Lane. Then your destination will be on the right. I put them in there because the Most High tell me to, and obedient. 